In the 1980s, Greenham Common was no longer the green and pleasant place it had been in the past. For hundreds of years, Greenham Common in southern England served as a shared resource for farmers and other local people. It was common land, accessible to all, and a place of great peace and natural beauty. During the Second World War, the common was taken over by the British government. From 1941 onwards, it became a military base, sometimes controlled by the British, sometimes by the USA. Always the public was denied access. In the 1980s, Greenham Common became the base for US cruise missiles carrying nuclear warheads. The US deployed cruise missiles all over Europe as part of NATO's strategy for fighting a limited nuclear war. In the volatile political climate of the time, opinions polarised around nuclear issues and Greenham Common became a potent symbol of protest. In the summer of 1981, a small group of women marched from Cardiff to Greenham to protest against the sighting of cruise missiles. They inspired many others to raise their voices. Women from all over Britain and from further afield set up peace camps outside the base in non-violent resistance. The women determined to maintain a permanent presence there until the missiles were gone. On occasions, over 30,000 women gathered to embrace the base and envision a world free of nuclear weapons. Some 30,000 women wing the nine-mile perimeter of Greenham Common Cruise Missile Base <laughs> in Berkshire yesterday in an emotional demonstration against nuclear weapons in such an inaccessible part of the country and in appalling weather conditions it was a, it was a remarkable show of strength of the